Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum viewers. How are you? I am Zuhayb and you are watching ZB Association YouTube channel. So viewers in this video we will discuss Transportation Engineering Lab number 9 to determine the martial stabilities test of bitumen. So let's start our today lectures. First of all designations. So designation relate in this experiments ASTM D15559-62 or MS and scope of this experiment to determine optimum binder controls of give, given bitumen by Marshall's method of mixed designs right and after the significance and uses of this experiment this test is used to determine the how much binders content added in as far 3 to 6 percent the original Marshall's method is applicable only the hot mix asphalt having mixtures containing aggregates with maximum sizes of 25 millimeter or less the aggregate size more than 25 millimeters uses the modified Marshall's method which means mixes are used in the surface course of rod and airfield pavement the desirable bitumen mix properties include stability density durability flexibility resistance or skiddings and workabilities during constructions right this is a scope or uses of martial stability after this related theory so there are different terms include in related theory first of all introductions this test is performed by Bruce Marshall's a uh, former bituminous engineers with the Mississippi State Highway Department. He formulated the concept of Marshall method for design paving mixtures. The US Army Corps of Engineers through extensive research and correlation studies improved and added certain features to Marshall's test procedures and ultimately develop mixed design criteria. Right? These are just introductions of Marshall's stability <coughs> methods. After the stabilities, stabilities is defined as resistance of the paving mix to deformations under load and is thus a test levels which causes strains depending upon anticipated field condition stabilities is a function of frictions and cohesions. Durabilities It is defined as the resistance of the mix against weathering with causes hardening and this depend upon losses of volatiles and oxidations. And how to, how we uh, adopt Marshall stability test? First of all, we introduce Marshall Marshall stability test. We know that what is Marshall stability test. So it is the resistance of plastic deformations of cylindrical specimens of bitumen mixtures measured when the same is loaded at the periphery at the rate of five cm per minute. What is principles of Marshall stabilities mixed design? Marshall stabilities is the resistance of plastic flow of cylindrical specimens of abituminous materials mixtures loaded on the later surface. It is the load carrying capacity of the mix at 60 degrees centigrade and it may in kg, right? So there are different operators that are used in this experiment. The first one is mold assembly, sample extractors, compaction, pedestals, hammers, breaking head, loading machines, flow meters, thermometers, water bath, etc. So there are different, uh, you show us pictures on the screens of apparatus. First one, figure one is, that is mold in figure 9.2 and uh, sieving arrangement so there are a fixed arrangement of the sieving's 12 4.7 mm and furthermore 12.5 and 4 and 20 mm so these are sieving arrangements and 
in previous this is cylindrical mold shown a figure 9.5 and simple extractors shows in a figure 9.6 and compaction pedestals shows in figure 0.9.7 and rammers shows in figure 0.9.8 so these are a loading machine shown on a figures uh, this is a gear and the loading jack this is a loading jack and this is a probing range right okay let's go on a procedure that a main part of this experiment procedure the first first of all sieving the aggregate of normal size of 20 mm weighing the different size of aggregate on weighing balance the final mix up blending blending of mixtures 1200 gram and second if we take to uh, 20 mm nominal size of aggregate the sample retain 0 gram we weight the aggregate of different samples on different sizes of sieve after this bitumen is heated 120 degree centigrade to 145 degree centigrade then preheating mold in oven additional mold is also heating keep the all aggregate for heating in oven bitumen is added into preheating aggregate in pan then mix it after this pour the bitumen in mold then and 75 blows on each side of mold the dropped height 45.7 centimeter weight is 4454 kg uses the filter papers on lower side of mold that materials should not be moved on lower side of the mold and then mold should be kept for cooling for 24 hours bearing ball use own color and heat with hammers to extract the mold after this put the mold into water for 20 minutes at 60 degrees centigrade weight the submerged weight of mold after 20 minutes fix the mold in testing machines break head adjust the screw and dial gauge on the machines started the machine note down the reading on a dial gauge upper dial gives the stability readings and lower dial gauge gives the check the mold knew how to much it is deformed and after this go on a observations and calculations so you just seen on a different calculation on a screen that uh, the first figure shown on screen this is a calculations of bitumen contents that is a weight air's weight weight of sample in water so there's just these are a values of different values of specifications of bituminous air voids and specific gravities of bituminous so viewers tell me how is this video if you like this video please comment on a video if any persons who have any ambiguation then comment me inshallah i will answer your questions if any persons who have not subscribed my channel please go on and subscribe my channels and click bell icon for newly notifications thanks for watching